In October 2017, astronomers were taken by surprise when they detected an unusual interstellar object speeding through our solar system. This mysterious body was given the name Umwamua, meaning scout or messenger in Hawaiian. At first, scientists didn't know what to make of it. But thanks to the advanced capabilities of NASA's James Webb Space Telescope, they have been able to capture the first detailed image of this strange cosmic visitor. This has opened new doors to understanding its nature and raised intriguing questions about its origin, some even speculating that it might have come from an extraterrestrial civilization. Umwamua wasn't an ordinary discovery. It was first spotted on October 19, 2017, after it had already been passing through our solar system for decades. Its closest approach to Earth happened after a journey that likely began over a hundred years ago, possibly even longer. Strangely, it wasn't detected until much later, when Robert Werrick, a researcher at the University of Hawaii, noticed a faint, fast-moving object in images taken by the Pan-STARRS-1 telescope. Its appearance and motion were unlike anything previously seen, igniting a wave of scientific curiosity and debate. Initially, researchers thought Oumuamua might be a comet, primarily because of its odd behavior. It was located in the region between Mars and Jupiter, but it didn't fit the mold of a typical comet or asteroid. Later observations revealed something even more puzzling. It was accelerating away from the Sun in a way that couldn't be explained by gravity alone. There were no signs of outgassing, no tail, no visible jets, yet the object was gaining. A speed. This lack of observable emissions challenged the usual comet classification and pushed scientists to consider other possibilities. Another curious detail was Oumuamua's rotation. Its brightness dimmed and brightened every 7.3 hours, suggesting that it was spinning on its shortest axis. This kind of motion pointed to a solid, compact structure, much more durable than most comets, which are typically made of ice and dust. Its surface also had a reddish hue, similar to some of the distant moons in the outer solar system, implying it had been bombarded by cosmic radiation over millions of years, altering its surface chemistry. The more scientists looked into Oumuamua, the more questions arose. Some proposed that it might be an alien probe or the remains of an extraterrestrial spacecraft. Others leaned toward more conventional theories, such as an unknown type of comet or a piece of a planet that was torn apart and ejected from another star system. Despite the various theories, there is still no clear consensus on what Oumuamua actually is, one thing is certain. It's not staying. The object is now traveling away from the sun at a steep angle and will soon leave our solar system forever, heading back into interstellar space. The discovery of Oumuamua sparked global interest, not just among astronomers and scientists, but also among the public. It's the first confirmed object to pass through our solar system from another star, raising exciting possibilities about what else might be out there. Is it simply a strange natural rock, or could it be something more, perhaps even evidence, of alien technology? Initially, scientists labeled it a rocky object, possibly an asteroid, but its extremely elongated shape, about 800 meters long and only around 80 meters wide, doesn't resemble any known asteroid or comet we've studied. As more data came in, some speculated that it could be filled with gas, which might explain the unusual acceleration. Then came an even more surprising theory. What if Oumuamua wasn't natural at all? Its non-gravitational acceleration led some researchers to wonder if it could be artificial. Normally, comets speed up because of jets of gas released as they approach the sun, a process known as outgassing. But Oumuamua showed no signs of this. That lack of evidence for outgassing pushed some experts to consider a radical possibility. Could it be a spacecraft, perhaps sent by an advanced civilization to observe our solar system? One notable idea came from theoretical physicist Dr. Avi Loeb, who suggested that Oumuamua might be a light sail, a thin structure propelled by radiation from the sun. This could explain its acceleration without the need for gas emissions. While this idea caught the imagination of the public, it remains speculative and has yet to be backed by concrete evidence. Other scientists offered more grounded theories. 
Some propose that Oumuamua may have been ejected from another star system during a catastrophic event, like a supernova. Billionaire Elon Musk and researcher Karen Meech floated the idea that it could have originated from a collision between two celestial bodies, forming a rare hybrid structure. Early on, astronomers even thought its trajectory pointed back to Vega, a bright star in the Lyra constellation. Calculations suggested it could have taken about 600,000 years to travel here from Vega. However, that theory was soon ruled out, as its path had changed, likely due to close encounters with other stars along the way. This indicated that Oumuamua might have been drifting through the Milky Way for billions of years before entering our solar system. Another fascinating idea came from Alan Jackson and Stephen Desch of Arizona State University, who proposed that the object could be a fragment of nitrogen ice, possibly chipped off a Pluto-like planet during a massive impact. If true, this would mean Oumuamua is much smaller and lighter than previously believed. The nitrogen ice theory has gained traction because it could explain both the composition and the strange acceleration. One of the most significant revelations about Oumuamua is its hyperbolic orbit. Instead of looping around the sun like planets and most comets, its trajectory is shaped like a boomerang, an unmistakable sign that it came from outside our solar system and is not coming back. This rare path reinforced the idea that we had just witnessed something truly unique, a visitor from another part of the galaxy. Still, questions remain about how exactly it accelerated. Its velocity reached 54 kilometers per second, nearly three times the average speed of comets in our solar system. Standard explanations like gravitational slingshots and outgassing don't fully account for this behavior. Most comets accelerate due to sublimation of volatile ices forming visible tails. But Oumuamua had no tail, no coma, and no observable dust or gas. This led to more speculation. One theory is that Oumuamua might be a fragment of a larger object that was torn apart by tidal forces during a close encounter with a star. This could explain its elongated shape, which resembles a cigar and is unlike anything previously seen in our solar system. However, this still doesn't account for the acceleration without visible outgassing. Another possibility is that Oumuamua could be an artificial construct, a piece of alien technology, or a probe launched by an intelligent civilization. Its odd shape and unexpected motion fueled this hypothesis. Some researchers noted that the object's structure could be consistent with a light sail, something designed to be pushed along by sunlight rather than relying on engines or gas. This kind of propulsion could explain the acceleration without visible emissions. While this idea remains unproven and is still viewed with skepticism by most in the scientific community, it has undeniably sparked curiosity and inspired new thinking about what's possible in the vastness of space. As Oumuamua continues its silent journey through the cosmos, it leaves behind a trail of unanswered questions. Its brief visit has challenged what we know about interstellar objects and reminded us that the universe is full of surprises, some of which may never be fully explained.